Hey everyone, it's Marissa here. Um, it's 9.30 at night and I have a full house. Um, I had the great idea of mentioning to my mom that her sisters should come and sleep over the house and have a sleepover and go to the bar and have some drinks and get drunk. Well, <laughs> by the time my aunts came, they were too tired so now they're in the living room chit-chatting and drinking um, some wine. And then um, my aunt also brought my little cousin. Well, not little. She's like 14, 15 with her. So now my daughter and her are playing the ukulele at 9.30 at night. And um, so we just have a whole bunch of things going on throughout the house. But anyways, um, today me, the little one, and my mom met my brother and grandmother on... Um, Another, on the other side of town, um, I live in Orange County, and um, we met in the middle, because my grandmother and my brother live in LA, so we met in Long Beach today, and there's like a, a pretty big, um, Michael's there, so I thought I would stop by there since it's on the way back home. Um, I was hoping to find some more good things on clearance, like I did in the last haul, um, but, um, didn't find too much so but I did want to share with you what I did get <clears throat> so I got I've never seen these before and um let's see if you can see the color see that's you could see it just a little bit but um recollection has their their own glitter glue now and um they're acid free and I thought I'd try these because I don't have these colors. And you guys, they are so, so gorgeous. Um, maybe that will help if I bring it out. But it's like a bright pink, a blue. Well, the, the pink is called blush. The blue is called frost. And the yellow is called sunflower and they are so pretty the color so I grabbed that and I think this was only like $3.99 so I got that and then um, I grabbed this um, damask ditto stamp and I think these were like I want to say $3.50 $3.99 or something because um, you guys know I have damask and I don't know why I haven't picked this up before but grab that and then I also grabbed the Ditto stamp that's on clearance. I grabbed that. And then I grabbed this one. I've never seen these ones, so this must be new. It's the Hampton Art Signature Collection. And it's the, um, let's see, does it have a name? It does not have a name, but it's like the typewriter alphas. So I thought that was pretty cool. So I grabbed that, and that was like $2.99. So everything I got today was like under like five dollars so I grabbed that stuff and then um, I picked up some recollection cardstock and they have new colors and I had to get it I love this one this stack is called preppy beach and you guys won't be able to see the color very well because of the lighting I normally like to um, film in the daytime but it has like um, like this what do you call this like a orangey pink coral color so um, and then it has like a blue gray and a pink but I thought this was a pretty color and you guys take my word for it but go to Michaels and check this um, recollection um, eight and a half by eleven paper out this one's called preppy beach and then I also got punchy florals which is a more um, brighter stack so I do not have any of these colors so I grabbed that and that was all that I grabbed from um, Michaels and then um, I also received in the mail a few things um, I ordered from the berry scrap and um, I s follow um, Alex who's Mrs. McCabe scraps on Instagram and Facebook and I'm subscribed to her on YouTube. Hi, Alex. Um, she's one of like the very first 
person that I've ever talked to on, um, oh crap, sorry. She's the, one of the first persons that I've ever talked to on, um, YouTube and befriended, so. Yeah. Sorry. I just worked on something and I just screwed it up. Darn it. Shit. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just gonna say what's on my mind. Uh oh, I hope I can save this. I was gonna show you something too that I worked on, but I may have messed it up. Maybe I can save it. But anyways, um, I grabbed this from the Berry Sweet Designs and it's the camera with the heart in the middle called Capture the Moment. And then I also got, I ordered some of their washi tape and it's the pink cameras with the polka dot and it is super duper cute see how cute that is so I grabbed that that came in the mail today and then um, I was working on a few things I was trying to work on something that didn't um, take up a whole lot of time since um, I have a lot going on here in my household. If you guys remember one of my Daiso hauls, I purchased a, um, a little mirror. You know, one of those mirrors that you can just throw in your purse. Um, I purchased one of those and then I just kind of altered it. Um, something simple and easy. Isn't that cute? It kind of looks like a cell phone, but I blinged it up on the front and the back. And then I just added the um, cherry blossoms that I got from Daiso. So I got the little, um, what is this? The little mirror from Daiso. See, and then you just open it up and there you go. So I altered that. And then I also altered, um, I don't think I showed you guys this, but I got these, um, sunglass cases from the Dollar Tree a little while ago, maybe like two weeks ago. And I don't think I showed you guys, but it looks like that. And then I just, um, what I did was I had these um, lace flowers that I made a oh, like long, long time ago when I first started um, crafting, and then I just added the um, the Babbers flat back pearls that I ordered from her with the buckles, and then I have my um, dollar um, cameo earring right here. Oops, not even in the frame, duh. But anyways, um, so. Let me see if you can see the color. There you go. So what I did was I just, um, I didn't glue it. I um, sewed the flower onto the case because, you know, it's going to be probably thrown in a purse and it'll probably get um, messed up somehow. So that's what I worked on. And then I also worked on, this is, um, it's a, let me see a paper bag card that I made and what happened was I when I went to go do the video I forgot that I put glass glossy accents on the flower and I tilted it like this so all the glossy accents dripped and I don't know if you can tell maybe just a tad bit it's all sticky down here but um I used the Victorian parlor color box collection for the paper and I put it on the back. I distressed it all over. I used some recollection trim and bling. Um, distressed the flowers. Um, and there are various different types of flowers that I used. I used a cutout from the Victorian parlor as well. And then I added some seam binding. And then inside I have a, a little card or note. And then I have some goodies in there as well. So it's for a friend for um, her birthday. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Some of the things that I just worked on this evening. 
So I hope everybody is having a good night and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.